<laughs> Moab. Hey guys, what's hanging? It sticks here. And before I get started in this commentary, I have to say one thing. <coughs> Moab! That's right, I'm playing face off on Erosion, and I got a Moab with my LMG. First things first, I lie down here, and I, I know there's gonna be people running this way, so I spray it. I get a kill right there. I get two kills actually, and it said kill denied, so, so I saw. So I saw, he must be right there. So I kept shooting, I got another kill. Then I kept shooting and I got another kill. And before you know it, I had I had a lot of kills. And, you know, a lot of people, like, when I go there first, I always run there. And I got that sniper right there. I sure did. Uh, with my LMG, I'm using Impact and Extended Mags. With Sl Scavenger as my first perk, and Slutty Hands my first specialist perk. The reason I do this is because I will have all the ammo I need, because I have extended mags and scavenger. All the ammo I need, I don't really need to reload because I have extended mags. I won't need to reload until after about two kills. So that's my sleight of hand. The reason I use impact is because in this map especially, which is where I use my LMG, you can spray through the doorways. They can't see, like, you can't see them, but you'll get hit markers, hit markers, hit markers. And with impact, they all equal about the same damage as if it was a regular bullet. So you'll kill them in like two or three bullets. And you can shoot through the walls and the tower and everything. And you can do so much damage that quick with an LMG. And I've been getting doubles and triples. People saying, ah, he has a mod, he has a hack. Aimbot, aimbot. And it's not. It's just, it's just I'm spraying through the walls. It's spraying and praying, except I know that they're there because I saw them run there. Or I have marksmen on so I can see their name. Or they're picking up my dog tag, so I know that they were right there. After the dust clears about two minutes, I come up here. And the way I see this tower, it's like a tower. It's kind of like a tower defense game where you have people coming from four different directions. And you kind of got to smack them away before they get into the tower. And the two main ways that you usually come is from the temple, which is where uh, the shiny part is. And the back area where we spawn. So I put my motion sensor down there, which is a very essential part. Uh, if you want to, you know, win because your teammates are usually watching your front because that's where most of the action usually is. So I put the thing down there to watch my back just in case. And you know, you, you just gotta kind of uh, work your way up. Blast shield's very important if you're gonna control the tower because once you get a ton of kills, people are gonna start shooting RPGs at you, fragging you, semtexing you, C4ing you, which is my favorite thing to do is to run up there, throw a C4 through one of the windows, detonate in midair, and blow up whoever's up there. It's, it's, it's really fun. C4 is a beast on this map. And I've actually, like, I leveled uh, this gun. I'm, like, a couple kills away from gold. Like, no joke. The L86. I leveled my MK46, which is the other LMG, up to gold. And I also leveled my KSG. Uh, I got a gold in one day playing fa uh, face off. So, like, I got 10,000 XP without doing any challenges. It's pretty crazy. Anyway. Once they breach the tower and they're kind of under there, you don't know where they're at, you gotta hope you have teammates by you. If they're good teammates, they'll take them down. That's why you wanna play with friends that you trust. Play with friends you trust, don't play with strangers, kiddies. But if not, you wanna kinda step back and you wanna see if you can see them and try and shoot down. Um, even if you don't have a good shot, you have a ton of ammo, you can just spray it. And another good, important thing to do is to move a lot because if I know a guy's up there and I have my LG, I'm going to spray the living daylights out of where he was. I'm going to spray there. You know, I'll mo most times I'll get a kill. And if they have explosives, they're going to shoot them up in there. And if you're in the same area where you were last time, they're going to kill you. There's no way around that. So you always got to be moving or twitching in case there's a sniper on you. That's why I'm always moving. Or, or I'm always changing corners where I'm at because um, they're like coming from a different way. Or, uh, you know, they're just, you know, they're over there somewhere. You have no idea how many close calls I had on this Moab. I, I, I was like, my heart was pounding. Like, I was like, oh, God. And there was one part where I thought I had I was, I was had 24 kills, but I didn't. Uh, it was that kill before that. And I thought I had 24 kills, but I only had 23. And I was like, oh, God, I need another kill. Don't want to stick my head out the window. And I got my Moab there. I called that sucker in in about, I called it in in 4 minutes and 30 seconds. So, what was it, 4 and 20? I think it was 4 and 30. So that's not that bad uh, for only having three guys to kill. Actually, one of them backed out in the middle of it. 
and I'm, I'm just gonna go two times mode the rest of it. It was a pretty good game. I mean, it's worth showing. I had like a, uh, I went like 48 and four, so I had like 12 KD. I got sniped back there somewhere. I actually was on like a, um, like a 12 kill streak near the end. I counted 12, 13 kills, but there was some lag. And if you see I'm lying down there in the temple, that's because if there's a guy down there, um, I'll spray, 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 like I did right there. There's a guy down there. Sometimes I keep spraying because they usually spawn in pairs, and you can get doubles. Same with those doors right there. You can spray down there, get those kills, and it just seems it seems to me like LMGs, like they have uh, bigger hitboxes. Like hitboxes are um, like. Where, you, where the bullets hit around them, that's what registers as a kill. Like, you know, where the bullets hit. It seems like LMGs, like, you don't have to hit them right on. Like, you can just hit them in the general direction. Kind of like with one in the chamber, I'm, yeah, I'm thinking. And right here, I start to go back on my kill streak, get a sleight of hand. And usually when I'm playing, I'll get up to, like, uh, I'll get up to, like, Assassin, which is, like, six, and then I'll get killed. Which kind of sucks. Uh, sometimes I'll get seven people. I, I'm not joking. I've gotten, one time I got seven people spraying that doorway. So I killed the entire team twice, and then I killed another person just from holding down the trigger. And, you know, it's pretty effective. And it's, it's just really, I mean, this I, this is a really accurate gun. I mean, it's, I mean, you might not think it is, but it actually is. Like, the sights, it hits pretty much on where it is, even though it shakes a lot. But because it has a lot of bullets, especially if you have extended mags, you're going to hit pretty much right on. And, okay, somewhere up here, there's a guy with an RPG kept running around with it and if you look at the scoreboard by the way we were not doing bad at all but there's a guy uh, somewhere around here with an RPG and I know he's there I'm sitting in the building waiting for him to come I can hear him on my headset and you know it was it was kind of bumming me out this part was kind of funny like I had to shoot through the wall kill him which happens a lot it's right up here uh, somewhere this guy has an RPG he almost blew me up and then I start shooting down here. I know there's a guy down there because my teammate killed him right here. I know there's a guy. Like, he's... Man. Okay. I promise. It's going to be so... See, if you just keep noticing, I'm always going over to the temple. I'm always looking. Like, I'm always looking and paying attention. I got a guy right there. All right. Now, there's a guy. I know he's coming around the corner right here. But he has an RPG. And I'm like, what the hell? And so the game starts lagging. I throw my C4. I was going to hit him. But the game lags, couldn't throw my C4 fast enough, I get killed by an RPG. Well, I was on like a 13 kill streak, something like that. No big whoop, I did really good, I went 48-4, my team won by like a ton, we went like 40, we went 47-7, which is really good. So make sure to like, comment, favorite, and subscribe, and have a fantastic day.